Hello Virgos, so this is the monthly reading that I have for you guys. So I'm going to start with the Romance Angel and the Kepler deck and the Tarot. Universe, we have four cards spread. What's going on with Virgos Love Life for May 2021? All right, Reconciliation. Universe, give me. It is safe for you to love. Universe, give me two more cards. Honeymoon. Universe, give me one more card. Calling your soulmate. Okay. Um, I feel like someone will want to write their wrong. Okay. They want to write their wrong in a big way. So I see trips for you. So Pisces had um, had like going on vacation too. I noticed with opposite signs, um, they tend to go through similar things at the same time. <laughs> so that's what I'm seeing for you guys. I'm seeing you guys are going on trips, vacation. I feel like this person is trying to show you they're serious this time. I've seen that this person is trying to like prove to you in a big way. Okay. Um, cause a lot of you guys free yourself from this. Okay. Connection. Let me clarify for yourself. Universe clarify for yourself. Universe clarify for yourself. Universe clarify for yourself. Deception. Okay. So many guys are not even taking this offer, even though they are serious this time. Um, it is because this person was keep on playing with you and you don't want to trust them anymore okay you risk clarify deception lego control issues and children yeah you feel like you can't trust them it's in here universe give me a four card spread what's going on with virgo's love life for may 2021 courtship and concern Universe, give me three my cards. What's going on with Virgo Love Life for May 2021? Child, universe, give me two my cards. What's going on? Despair, universe, give me one my card. What's going on? Sudden wealth, okay. Hmm. Great fortune. So this is not going to apply for everyone. Um, I feel like if you do have kids for this person with this person. It's like they want to make things right in a really good way um, for the kids, okay? It sounds very cliche, but I really do see that they do want to make things right for the kids. Um, and they actually mean it. Um, and this probably caught you, by, um, caught you by surprise, you know, like you're really surprised by this. I feel like your kids was affected by this, okay? Like probably your kids um, was not doing as great or as good that they typically do in an academic um in academia basically and i'm seeing that this really is a wake-up call for them to get the ish together and i'm seeing that they are trying to make things right with you being better parents i mean being a better parent and just being a better um, romantic partner okay so let's see with the tarot So, universe, give me a five card spread. What's going on with Virgo's love life for May 2021? Oh my gosh, Pisces have that in the same position. That's creepy. <laughs> um, so, so we get to deal with the Pisces. So, I feel like there was a moment where you probably felt like this. Okay, I'm seeing that you guys don't get out of it. Universe, give me five cards. What's going on with Virgo's love life for May 2021? Temperance. Yep, look at this. Bouncing back. Okay. Universe, give me three my cards. What's going on? Okay, Will of Fortune want to show itself in reverse? Who wants and um, want to show itself? So again, from this person from the past. Universe, give me three my cards. What's going on with Virgo's love life? Who their swords? Okay. I feel like you are rising on top. There's a lot of you know animosity, adversity, but you're rising. Okay, Universe, give me two my cards. What's going on? Wow, Ten of Cups in the verse. You're rising. So I feel like this is a test, and you're going to use this as a testimony. Inference in the verse. Okay. So I guess right now it's showing this is not going to apply for every Virgo. 
or I have multiple Virgos to be honest. Um, I'm the one I'm reading for right now. I'm seeing is um, you guys are um, getting affected by a lot of things, not just one sector of your life, not only in your love life. I'm seeing family, um, particularly your mother as well, um, or maternal figure. A lot of stuff is like being thrown at you basically but i've seen that you are gonna be at you're gonna you're gonna resolve things okay with the temperance being here okay right, universe cover the inference in reverse the tower oh okay so something unexpected happened universe cover the tower this truth may came out about a past person that you dealt with but it's like your intuition was telling you to like be careful with this person Universe, come for the Ten of Cups in reverse. The star. Yeah, I feel like you're going to rise above this. This test is going to be used for your testimony, okay? Um, a lot of this honesty, in and out. Universe, clarify the Five of Swords in reverse. Four of Swords in reverse. I feel like what this person did to you, they're going to get it back, okay? They will get it back. The universe... They will get it back, okay? If it's cut back there once. Yep, how they did you, they, somebody gonna do them 10 times worse. Universe, cut back their swords. Five of Cups in reverse, see? You're rising above it. You're rising above it. Universe, cut back Five of Cups in reverse. Yep, you're blocking, you're protecting your energy, okay? And you're manifesting way better. Universe, clarify the temperance. Queen of Cups. You're going to the Queen of Cups, Ace of Cups. I do see new love here. Um, some of you guys are birthing a child, so congratulations. Okay. Universe Cup of Ace of Cups. Yep, you're moving on. Not looking at the past anymore. Universe Cup of the Sun in reverse. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Okay, so this person was giving a lot of instability. Um, I don't feel like this person was genuine at all. Okay. Um, I feel like this person was trying to block you and that's why they come in and out your life. So when they come in, those that won't open it up, open up again and you get emotionally attached again. Okay. And you don't see nobody else. <laughs> and that's why they come in and out because they wanted you to not move on from them. But a lot of you guys see right through them and you're rising above it. Okay. So Libra had a similar energy to like this but it was more like a third person was trying to attack what they have with somebody okay i'm seeing this is like somebody that you was dealing with from your past or currently um this person was intentionally trying to block you and you see right through them okay um the signs i got a lot of signs sagittarius leo um taurus virgo okay a libra as well with the other dog. Hey, universe, give me a four card spread. What message do you have for Virgos and the person that's on Virgo line for May 2021? Yeah, so I feel like everything is a, it's a blessing in disguise, okay? This person was trying to really block you with the seduction, okay? Um, wedding rings. This person could have been in a relationship or married. Union, wedding, marry, soul connection, eternal love, everlasting promise. Coffee cup, um, meeting, conversing, saving the moment, feeling uplifted, friendship, um, runner, running in a codependent relationship, fear of intimacy, listen to ego. This person had a huge ego, talking, interested, conversing more. Yeah, this person all the time come back when you was dating somebody. And they probably didn't like see that in their own within their own eyes. But it's like they can feel like you're you're moving on and they always come in and out. Okay, that's what I'm seeing. And they was really trying to block you, okay? Seduction, attraction, flirting, dating, hooking up, temptation, their party interference. Universe, give me a four-card spread. What messages do you have for Virgos? 
Love Begins, which is the Ace of Cups, Light, which is the Star, um, Firm Foundation, which is Four of Wands, okay? So I do see new love here. And really, once you move on, you are going to have this new love and chance, especially your Aries, um, Sagittarius, Leo. Um, this is someone who's really going to go out and beyond for you, okay? And your intuition is going to tell you, like, entertain this person, okay? I got three swords again, okay? So take this as a blessing in disguise. What didn't work out for you was actually for your best interest, okay? Because I do see something way much better happening for you guys. Okay. Universe, give me a four card spread. We must just okay, answering the call. So I feel like this is more like if you seeing things clearly for what it is. Okay. You getting that peace, that clarity. Okay. And surrendering to the journey. Release control. Yep, you letting go. I feel like you was really trying to fix this person, but this person didn't want to be safe. Um, answering the call, the time is now. Solitude and silence peace prevails. Begin now. Take your first step. Distant thunder. Clear the air. Okay. I feel like this is you clearing your energy from this person. Okay. Universe, give me a three-card spread with messages. Take time to take action. New moon in Aries. Um, time to release negativity. Full moon and Scorpio. Okay. So I'm seeing you are gonna move on from them. You are. So a time to give rather than take a new one in Virgo. So a new cycle is opening up. Energy is gaining momentum. I feel like it's more like the truth. You seeing them for who they are. Waxing moon. Adjustments are required. Third quarter moon. Okay. A time for healing. Bosmic moon. Have faith in your dreams. Wax, waxing crescent moon. And then I got show the world the real you. Full moon in Aquarius. So some of you guys are releasing Aquarius. A Scorpio. Out your life. Welcoming a new... Virgo or Aries. Okay, universe, we have four cards, Brad. Okay. So I got listen to your intuition, opportunity, take action. So take action came out twice and wait. So I feel like the universe is trying to say continue to move on and move forward because you're going to meet someone way much better with the opportunity being there. It might be at work, okay? And don't stop. Yep, the universe is trying to say continue to move forward. Okay. Universe, give me a two card spread. What message do you have for Virgos? Pertain to their love life. May 2021. Universe, give me one more card. At the bottom of the deck, I got embracing change. Okay, 43, which reduced to a seven numerology, which is all about completion. With every loss, I understand that something new is about to be birthed beyond what I can imagine. So, again, it was for your best interest. Okay, everything happened for a reason. Love based reality. I'm so nurtured when I surround myself with friends and family who support love based reality, which is the essence of Virgo. Virgo. It's being a little sign. You guys love to be around people. Okay. So the universe is trying to say, get closer to your friends and family. Um, infinite self. My infinite self dwells in the sweetness of this very moment. Okay. 23 reduced to a 5. Okay. 2 plus 3. 5. Which is all about change. Okay. So this is all for your best interest. Okay. And the universe is trying to say, be prepared for something that's way greater and grander than what you experienced before. Okay. So that's the reading that I got for you, Virgos. Thank you guys for watching my video and subscribing. If this video resonates, you can definitely book a personal read with me at queenfortheterial at gmail.com.